Hello! Well, what I have here is a regular deck of cards. Well, not exactly regular, for one. Ah! <laughs> for one, uh, it's uh, still a 52 card deck, but the suits are a bit different. Instead of having your regular suit, you'd have um, coins, coins, clubs, actual clubs, swords, and cups. Cups. So, you have your cups, your coins, your swords, your cups, and clubs. See that? Clubs. Now it's a regular, same, usual deck, 52 cards, four suits and everything, but it's this magic trick that I learned. Well, it's not a magic trick. It's a, it's a, it's a card trick. A card trick. It's a trick that you do with the cards, which is very, very interesting, which actually, t which actually has a wonderful, you know, sub-idea to how to meet new people and get to know them. When you get to know new people, you don't really know who they are, but you kind of want to know specific details. You have to try to, you know, lead the conversation, but, you know, it's, but this is like the most perfect idea, which I learned from, from this guy who um, I was translating for. Uh, I had a job for two weeks being a translator on a factory fishing boat. It was at port. They were trying to fix the blast chillers and the refrigerator guy. He was um, from Argentina and spoke nothing of English. So I learned this trick because I had a deck of cards in my... In my um, with me because I usually take a deck of cards for no particular reason and he decided to show me this trick and it was really impressive so I'm like ah and the thing is he even showed me and it wasn't that he showed me it's just that he explained to me the single clue to figure it all out so quite simply I would you know I just shuffled the deck up you know da -da 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 -da. now I don't know how to set up cards I really don't so if I could it'd be, this would be really interesting so I'm gonna you know just go with one more shuffle see mm -hmm. What were those cards? I have no idea. Okay, so I'm simply going to keep this deck of cards right on my head, okay? So I'm going to keep them right up here so that you know that I'm not fidgeting with them as much as I could be. Yeah. Now, ow. Ooh, I got a. Yeah, I knocked my head in a few days ago. A bit tender. Alright, so, um. Alright. So it's pretty simple. The trick goes as so. You have to ask questions. You ask the person of what is the card that we could be pulling. But it's not that what the card would be pulling, what kind of deck of it is, and we'll do a process of elimination to draw the specific card. Now remember, it's a regular deck, 52, uh, you know, ace, 2 to 10, and the uh, three face cards that will be the jack, the queen, and the king. Pretty easy, right? Ugh. Now, Quite simple. You just ask questions. Process of elimination. You figure out what kind of we're dealing with. First, how many cards are in the deck? Um, Fifty-two. Regular set, right? All right, good. Then you ask the then you ask whoever you are presenting this card trick to. Um, and how many suits are in there? Okay, uh, there'll be four suits. Uh, what are the four suits? Uh, can you remember? It'll be the coins, the cups, the clubs, and the swords. All right. So coins, cups, coins, cups clubs and swords. Cords, yeah, those. So we got our four suits. Now out of our four suits, we're going to choose two of them. Um, then you ask them to choose two of them and let's see. They tell you, all right, so let's say cups and coins. All right, so cups and coins. So you have cups and coins and what were the other two? The other two were clubs and swords. So you have uh, the set of coins, cups, clubs and swords and coins and clubs were chosen. Now, and then from there, the other two were swords and clubs. So we're going to say swords and clubs. So we're going to go choose swords and clubs there. Now, as we do this, uh, we're going to choose another one now. Um, so let's see. Uh, let's see what to do, what to do. Which one will you choose? Now, let, tell me. Now, the, they have to answer. It's, it's we're trying to process the elimination here, okay? So we're trying to figure it out. Um, they say, uh, how about clubs. Alright, they chose clubs. The other one was swords. And we got clubs and swords were the last two left because the first two were eliminated, which was coins and cups. So coins and cups were eliminated. Then we have clubs and swords. Clubs were chosen. Um, now we're going to uh, have that eliminated and have swords. Now we're down to swords. Now we got the swords left. Now swords, um, like it's a regular deck, how many cards are in a suit? Which would be 13. That would be ace, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, Jack, 
king, and queen. Yeah. So, we have those cards. That's the 13 cards that we have. Now, as we have the 13 cards there, um, we're going to choose one of these cards. Now, the thing is that we're going to first uh, process of elimination again. Now, back, let's uh, think about um, five cards. Let's go with five cards. Choosing five random cards. Um, king, queen, ace, five, and three. Wow, that's very odd. Okay, so uh, king, king, queen, ace, five, and three. Um, king, queen, ace, five, and three basically leaves me with shit. What does it leave me? Oops, sorry for the language. Um, so it'll leave me. So let me put it in order first. It'll be ace, three, five, and the last two face cards. So let me go to it'll having two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, jack. All right, so. That's what we have left. Two, two, four, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Not eleven. That's Jack. Sorry. <laughs> um. So, all right. So we got that. What's left? Now we're gonna go with choosing a few more cards. Uh. Let's say. Um. Let's go with eight, nine, seven, two. Eight, nine, seven, two. Why do I keep on doing that sequence? Eight, nine, and seven. Back into seven and two. Okay. Eight, nine. Eight nine seven two. That means two seven eight nine. Let's eliminate two seven eight nine there because it leaves us with what are the other numbers that are left? We have um, four, four, six, ten. Four six ten and jack. Now four six ten and jack is what we have left. Now to four six four six four six ten and and the jack is what we have left. Now we're going to, let's say, let's choose three of them. Uh, to, uh, no. Two, was it for two? Yeah, no. Four, six, four, six, ten, two, four, six, ten, jack. Four, six, ten, jack. We're going to choose, uh, let, let's just go with two of them. Choose two of them. So let's go six and and ten. Six and ten. All right. If we go with six and ten, uh, the other two cards would be Four and Jack. Now four and Jack. Out of four and Jack, um, we're going to choose one of those. Okay. Now out of uh, four and Jack, we choose Jack. Now out of the Jack, um, what was that original? Um, that original suit. Um, that suit was 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 swords. So the 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 card that we're going to go for is the Jack of Swords. All right. That's the card, right? So I'm going to draw the card here. That the yeah that is that is the jack of swords awesome so that's how the trick goes if you have any questions ask me again and I will you know explain it well all right so from this deck jack of swords as I said it's a trick you can ask. Yeah, it, I swear to God, I have no idea how to set these cards up. God, I can't even shuffle them without dropping them. Alright, so, any questions? Ask me about it.